Hi, this is Trey Pastor. They released a trailer, Tenet, the official trailer today. That's the latest Christopher Nolan movie, which comes out next year, I believe next summer, starring John David Washington, you know, Denzel's son, and Robert Pattinson, the new Batman. So let's see what this is about. I know it's supposed to be a spy thriller thing. So I'll be back, right back. From my okay, let me put my headphones in. Okay, here we go. Right now, go. We all believe we've run hmm. into the burning building. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. But until we feel that heat, yeah. we can never know. Good point. You do. You chose to die instead of giving up your colleagues. Oh, Jesus. That test you passed? Not everybody does. <laughs> Welcome to the afterlife. <laughs> Chris Nolan. To do what I do, I need some idea of the threat we face. As I understand it, we're trying to prevent World War Three. <laughs> Nuclear holocaust. No. Something worse. <laughs> All I have for you is a word. Tell it. <laughs> It'll open the right doors. Some of the wrong ones. Too. <laughs> Can I bribe? Oh. Robert Pattinson. You have to start looking at the world in a new way. <laughs> Oh. Don't try to understand it. Jesus. What the? Feel it. It'll happen here. Hasn't happened yet. What? Oh! <laughs> okay, July 17th. Oh, that's gonna be awesome. That's true. See that in theaters, right? <laughs> oh my God, that was fun. <laughs> that looks freaking awesome. <laughs> you know, that's gonna be good. And I know I read a little bit about it because I read Christopher Nolan was talking about it. I think in an interview saying they filmed it in like seven different countries and stuff, and it's like a spy thriller thing. And it looks good. I'm that's from the little that we've seen there so far. But then Christopher Nolan knows how to make a movie, so I have full faith this is gonna be freaking awesome. And I'm glad John David Washington is getting this big role in this side. Uh, he's like the main character in this, which is good. Robert Pattinson's there. I saw Kenneth Branagh there and Elizabeth DeBrocki. She was in Widows. Uh, so I'm looking forward to this movie. Uh -huh. Christopher Nolan, you know, he's going to give you a, a great movie. And he, like I said, he said he filmed it in seven countries and stuff. And it's a really spy thriller. And this looks intense, <laughs> intense and really, really good. So I, I, I have no doubt this is going to be an awesome movie. Christopher Nolan doesn't disappoint. So anyway, let me know what you think of this official trailer for uh, Tenet. Uh, what do you think of it? I'll leave a link to it in the description box so you can check it out for yourself. I also have links to my Facebook, my Twitter, my Instagram. I also have a link to my other channel, 12 Views and Opinions. Please check that out as well. And this is Trey Pastor saying so long and take care. I just wanted to add one less thing to this trailer reaction. You saw the trailer action, my trailer reaction to the Tenet movie, but I didn't talk about what, what I wanted to talk because I went back and watched the trailer a couple more times about... Now I think it is something to do, and then of course seeing the lettering, how it's backwards, how the how the uh, the the E and the T's <laughs> is backward, and of course tenant backwards and forwards is the same thing, and so now I, it, it is sort of gives you that sort of inception, maybe uh, maybe it's said something with time, because especially from what he said about this doesn't happen like when they're looking at the bullet holes, it hasn't happened yet, and then of course you see the car flipping over on the highway, then it flips back. So it looks like time reverse. So I don't know if he's part of an agency that's either they're investigating these things or somebody's weaponizing this ability to, to, to manipulate time and stuff. Maybe he's part of that, trying to figure out what that is exactly, which will be cool. That would be cool. So maybe that's a whole part of it, what's going on. And like I said, the actor, like, like I said, maybe, like I said, he was, because I understand his character, you know, like I said, it was a test, obviously, that beginning part, he's a test. And he passed because he didn't give up his colleagues, so they let him join this agency, this super secret agency, and they're supposed to stop some big threat that's going on. And maybe it's the threat is the time 
the manipulation of time, which kind of makes sense. That would that would be because you can imagine if rogue nation can manipulate time, they can go back and change things and manipulate things to, to their advantage. So that would be a big deal. So that's why this gets me super pumped for this movie. That that looks like a very interesting concept. The ability to, to manipulate time, and maybe that's why she said it's bigger than a nuclear heart, because you can manipulate time. You can you can you can do a lot of things, a lot of scary things. <laughs> okay, you, you manipulate time, so that is, that's why that is a big deal, and this does feel like a big feel movie. So I'm happy for John David Watt, uh, Washington being the lead in that, and of course Rob Pattinson's there with him. Okay, so I'm looking forward to seeing this movie because this, you know, I'm a big Christopher Nolan fan, and this looks super got me super pumped to see it. Anyway, let me know what you think down below, and let me know what you think of this trailer and what you think this movie's about. Okay, and this is Trey Pass again saying so long and take care.